Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Muhammad Ustakim And team member is Waris Atika Karina and Husna We will present the first Takafu revenue article Is Takafu in class introduced two new product And second Takafu revenue is Future strategy can be considered of planning and implementation First article discusses about Takafu Ikhlas introducing two new product namely Ikhlas Bersama and Ikhlas Dariku. Both of its new product will make it easy of the public to get comprehensive and flexible Takafu coverage. The method used by Takafu Ikhlas state that the prevalence of Ikhlas Bersama and Ikhlas Dariku is that it has the special benefit of accelerated die expenditure. The objective of this article is to reduce the financial burden of the family due to the die of a loved one. With the introduction of Ikhlas Bersama and Ikhlas Dariku product from Takafu Ikhlas, Takafu Ikhlas customers will experience many benefits as Ikhlas Bersama provide basic die insurance as well as additional comprehensive coverage option covering critical illness, total disability and intensive care in hospital coverage. Thank you, Mustaqim. As our first presenter, uh, explanation about the first article about Takafu Ikhlas introduce new product. Jadi Takafu Ikhlas, company yang kami beli ini mengenalkan dua produk terbarunya. Seperti yang uh, we explain about, uh, we uh, Takafu Ikhlas introduce new product, namely Ikhlas bersama and Ikhlas dariku. What of its new product will make it easier for the public to have comprehensive and flexible takaful protection? Then, uh, there are uh, several uh, differentiation be- uh, we- between uh, ikhlas dariku and ikhlas bersama. So, let's discuss about it. For the ikhlas bersama uh, and ikhlas dariku have uh, similarity like have a special benefit of accelerate, accelerate the expense or EDE ADE for example with ADE the next of kin will receive up to 20 20 20 ringgit 20 dollar 20 ringgit of the immediate coverage amount in the event of the participant death And then the objective of this article is to reduce the financial burden of the family due to the death of a loved one. Jadi uh, produk ini mengkhususkan untuk para uh, keluarga yang ditinggalkan oleh orang yang tersayang. Ditinggal di sini artinya ditinggal meninggal lah, ditinggal mati. Jadi for example the beneficiary will be given an additional payment of 100% of the basic cover amount for death due to cancer and additional 2000% of the basic cover amount for accidental death and an additional 13% 300% of the basic cover amount if the participant dies while performing haji or umrah jadi akan ada nilai tambahan sekitar 300% ketika uh, yang me- yang meninggal itu sedang dalam pada sedang dalam melakukan haji atau umrah and then meanwhile ikhlas dariku Ikhlas, uh, ikhlas bersama itu providing basic debt insurance as well as additional comprehensive uh, coverage of options covering critical illness, total disability, and intensive care within a hospital coverage. Meanwhile, Ikhlas Dariku provides a protection product that relies on grants, warranties, and has an additional debt benefit. The two products focus on helping to ease the family's financial burden due to the loss of loved one, especially those who will live at the background of the family. Jadi, uh, membantu uh, para mangsa yang ditinggalkan yang tidak ada penghasilan lain dari karena setelah ditinggalkan oleh tulang punggung keluarganya. And then, uh, it is hope that the two product will continue Uh, to run in order to help and facilitate the community because the system is comprehensive and flexible as well as since the takeaway customers are very much looking forward to using this product for the sake of their two products surviving in the long term jadi diharapkan juga untuk para customer 
uh, Takaful Ikhlas untuk menggunakan dua produk terbaru ini agar dua produk yang baru diluncurkan ini bisa bertahan lebih lama. Oke, okay, lanjut ke artikel berikutnya ke next presentator. The time is yours. Assalamualaikum everyone. So I'm going to continue with the next presentation is the future strategies that can be considered for planning and implementation. First of all, there is need there is a strong need to perform more globalized takafu industry through greater connectivity across jurisdiction. Takafu operators need to give satisfactory importance on cross-border association at regional and international levels. Second, there is also need attempts toward rigorous branding for takafu that must be recruited and developed. Through intensive branding, we could improve the appeal of Takafu to the global community. The Takafu of maturity, transparency and assistance could be further popularized to lead exclusive products. Lastly, Takafu is like any other business that deals with a huge number of customers must be well appointed with infrastructure that can aid, accelerate processes and enhance the position to alleviate risk in this region. It is not limited physical infrastructure infrastructure such as in IT but also the re- regulatory framework that must be reinforced. Assalamualaikum everyone. My name is Noratika Binti Abdullah. So I'm going to continue with the last part for this uh, magazine which is the conclusion. Takaful industry in Malaysia is quite new when compared to other areas. Conversely, even takaful growth remain lesser but there is momentous prospect for future growth. One advantage that makes Takaful industry in Malaysia propagate positive is the participation of Bank Negara Malaysia. The encounters range from competitive components, business models and practices altering the customer to altering customer requirements and demands. So Takaful industry trying to enhance the competitiveness and to comply with Syariah demands which treating the customer and the Takaful company equitably. Therefore, Takaful industry should comply with new trends in global economic to be the most competitive worldwide and be the only choice among customers uh, whether Muslim or non-Muslims. Moreover, for technical challenges, there are also le- regulatory challenges with the Takaful industry. Due to the difference in Sharia interpretation, it is hard to create global standards or regulation in the Takaful. That's all from our group. Thank you for your time.